and start applying for their COVID bonus pay. Not everyone, of course, is eligible, but many workers who stayed on the front lines, stayed on the job through the deadliest days of the pandemic could cash in. Bill Keller is live in Minneapolis this morning with everything you need to know about this process. Good morning, Bill. Good morning, Hannah. In fact, frontline workers could see checks of around $750. Now, this depends on how many people actually apply. But state officials expect to see more than 650,000 people to sign up for their share of the $500 million in COVID relief money. Now, workers in 15 different industries are eligible, including health care, first responders, and child care, along with food service and grocery store workers. Now, you can apply online. The site goes live at 8 o'clock this morning, one hour away. But because this is not first come, first serve, state officials are telling people there really is no rush. My goal is we've got 45 days to capture all the eligible people. We need to do that. If there are some glitches in the early hours, you can rest assured that we're prepared to deal with that. And we have the next 44 days to get them on board. Now, to qualify, you must have worked at least 120 hours during the first 15 months of the pandemic and not received more than 20 weeks of unemployment benefits. There is also an income cap, but that can be raised for anyone who worked directly with COVID patients. Eligible workers can apply through July 22nd, and there is an appeals period for people who do get denied, but the Labor Department expects to start sending out those payments in early fall. Kelly and Hannah.